look at this, you know. uh, away from home is Mike where you get more touches. What he's got, 30, 33 touches today. Against Bournemouth, he only had eight touches. And a lot of teams drop deep, you know, when they go to yeah. Etihad. So maybe away from home, this is where you're going to see him a lot more involved in the game. He had chances. He probably scored, should have scored a, a hat-trick today. Um, but he still gets his goal. Yeah. And he's making them, them runs that makes it difficult for defenders as well. Yeah, but with, on... Counting the number of touches. This is, this can't be a thing going forward that we're counting the number of touches that Erling Haaland has in, in a match. Well, well, it's, surely it's about the effect on the outcome. That, it that he it has. is about the effect. But if you have to look, it's not fair to say, oh, he only got eight touches. You have to look how Man City plays. They were playing against Bournemouth, who was sitting around the box. He's not going to touch the ball a lot. He's going to touch the ball in, in the box majority of the time and he needs to be sharp in the box and normally he is sharp in the box especially at home when they with all the respect when you are playing against the Bournemouth you know today there is more space yes. bigger pitch more space they are playing different they are more attacking and then there is more space behind well, the striker, Jimmy, you know you do get frustrated though when you not touch the ball you know, I wouldn't get frustrated in the Man City team because I know eventually I will touch the ball in the right position and I will get a chance. But you, he knows as a striker, one of the best, every performance is going to get scrutinised. Yeah. And although he got the assist yeah. last week, he's still thinking, you know, I want to be a little bit more involved in the game. At the right times, yeah. at the right times he wants to be involved. The, 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 the pressure, he will have to deal with it. If he wants to become the best player ever, he has to be able to, to, to handle the pressure that Ronaldo, Messi, Mbappe, all those players are getting, you know? So that shouldn't be a problem. Mm -hmm. Every game, they're going to look at him, what he does. Yeah. And today, at, at, at moments, he was brilliant. At other moments, he needs to grow. He needs to get better at holding the ball, especially when the ball is in the air and, and going for headers. Um, but... He's only still young. And he's still having impact. 